Hello, welcome to this tutorial. I'm Maurice Dimba, and today I'm going to show you how to generate a material list from a model in Techno Structures using uh, Organizer Tool. Welcome once again, and let's get started right away. We have the model right here on our screen, and what we want to do, we want to get uh, the part list for all these members so that we can uh, help the procurement people to procure the material for, uh, for the model or for the structure now i'll go straight to manage button here and i'll go straight to organize and prior to doing that there's a quicker way you can do that uh, in tecla structures 2018 what we can do now we, we can do first we just go to drawing and reports here and we go straight to design grouping here we go to design grouping right there we just click there and if you've not numbered your model you can do that by clicking uh, perform numbering from all and after doing that you can go ahead and click this button here create report you can create the a report that will uh, uh, cover all the members all the parts that are inside the model now i'll go straight away and click uh, create a report and we'll give it time to load everything for us so that we can have a preview of everything right here let me just pull this aside just pull this aside here we, here is our report here it's a very small window and you can maximize this to look a little bit bigger and also we can close this because it has no use for us now we have the title here here you can you can fix you you, you can feed your company and uh, the address whatever you want to and these are the profiles used we have the shs the square section the square hollow sections and uh, these are the dimensions here and these are the grids uh, the grid lines and the weights alongside them you can scroll down and go all the way to the bottom end here you can see everything already detailed right there now this is just a preview of what you expect to see in your final uh, material list now i'll close this and i'll go straight to to manage here then come to organizer tool right there then we'll give it time to load everything to give us the windows where we will be able to manipulate everything to access the actual thing we intend to to see or to have which is the material list for the whole model we'll give it time to load fully here it is we have a small window here and uh, there's a small question here do you want to synchronize organizer with the model right now just go ahead and click synchronize and we'll give you time to load to synchronize every, uh, our model with the the organizer we'll give it some bits of seconds we are going to do we'll go straight to material here and click this uh, arrow right there on material then we'll go straight to steel we want to get uh, the material list for the steel model only now i'll go straight and click and click steel and give it time to load everything on this end there it is it has been loaded but uh, it has been uh, the default setting has been picked and we don't want to use a default setting now under the under default here There's a drop-down arrow here and we'll click that drop-down arrow to check on on the variety varieties of uh, of uh, Lists here and we want this part list here I'll pick on part list so we get the the whole part list generated and we can also export these to uh, excel sheet so that whoever want to have a soft copy or uh, uh, a soft copy and it can be printed out in case you you want to see a hard copy and also in the excel sheet it's also possible to any person that doesn't have tecla structures or doesn't have the the knowledge of how tecla structures work have a look at these part list in 
an excel sheet now i'll go straight here and uh just let me just move down to the bottom end here you can also see the number of objects in this table is uh, 591 the total parts of the whole model now i want to export these to to excel sheet just go straight to this arrow or you can come this you, know, you can come to this radio button here and click on that then you can go all the way down here and uh, click export from there we'll give you time to to export that to excel sheet now we have the root here we can get our file on c drive tecla structure let me just click that drop down uh, drop down arrow you can you can retrieve your file on this root all the way to that end and uh, also it will open automatically when uh, you've you've exported this to excel sheet now what i'll do i'll just go ahead and click export i'll click export right there and it will give you time to load once again you can you can see a preview of of the excel sheet at this end now we can go ahead and and click on this excel sheet and uh, make it a little bit bigger and play around with the size of the content here now i'll come here and, and change this to give it nine change that to nine we can select everything here and uh, we ch want to change the font size here to eight right there and uh, we drag this drag this all the way to this end all, all the way to this end all the way to that end and we bring this here and just drag that to that end And also bring this one we'll uh, we'll have to do uh, away with the one let me just drag that and to that end perfect what we want is just this content and prior to that let me just change the page layout here come to page layout here and I want to give it an uh, give it a landscape and here we are it is in landscape now and here is now manipulatable if you are familiar with excel operations you can feed your company name there the address and uh, the project name the project address uh, the project number and the author the list number so we have the details of every part here and the total weight of the whole structure is down here you can see that it is 17 tons 17.443 tons and uh, the total number of parts are 591 you can see that the numbering are, are question marked because i didn't number my model completely because um, i'm yet to, to generate the the working drawings for the whole model so i've gone ahead and generate first the part list or the material list for our model first just to show you how to create that in a quicker way now let me just zoom up zoom out uh, or scroll up this is i'm confusing this with the tecla structure here we don't zoom we just scroll up up and down now you can pre place your logo there and the details uh, and the location of your company right there and the status of the project which you're generating material list for now from here you can just save this into in in, uh, in pdf by just going straight to file right there click file right there maybe click uh, save us right there once you've done that i want to save this on my desktop i've picked that option 
and once that has been loaded and i'll pick uh, uh server's type here i'll pick uh, a pdf right there once that has been done and i'll change that name from default and name it material list right here material list right there then go ahead and click save on desktop let me select that and I'll click save and we'll give it time to load and generate a copy of this document into uh, a PDF and this we, you can share or we can share everyone who who want to, to take a look on uh, the total number of materials required for such a particular model and particularly it's very important for material procurement for the whole structure it will be helpful to procurement uh, office let's give it time to load in uh, pdf and uh, we we'll we'll take a look at it how it looks in pdf format you can see everything here this is the object browser and you can see everything has been loaded here and uh, this once it has been exported to excel sheet now you can use your your skills of excel sheet to come up with a better better arrangement of this material list uh, as long as you don't interfere with the weight and the details arrangement just working on the presentation of the whole uh, information in in excel sheet so that you can convert this into into pdf and you can share it with the relevant people now i'll go ahead and close this or uh, I'll, let me just scroll down so that you can have a, a complete look at this let me just scroll down let's just scroll down scroll down scroll down to the bottom end we want to see the end of this the end of this list just drag this to the bottom end here we can see this this is the total length of materials of our model is 1.036 million millimeters the total of lengths of material that, that uh, we required to use and the total weight is 17 tons right there the total number of objects are 591 591 and from there we'll wind up and uh, let's meet on the next presentation and uh, the next presentation we are going to generate the working drawings for our model right here in particular structure this model you're seeing here will generate the the, the assembly drawing the the ga drawings and many other now let's meet on the next presentation and bye bye i'm Maurice Nimba. don't forget to subscribe to this channel if you're new to this channel and let's meet then